What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to theme the volume panel on your Android device. This is all made possible by developer Thomas Barrasso and his app Noise Volume Panel, which amazingly does not require root or any special permissions. You can find the app on the Play Store, so go ahead and search it by name to get it installed. When you first launch Noise, the app hasn't been fully enabled just yet, so toggle the switch at the top right to On, then Noise will offer to take you to a page where you can enable its accessibility plugin. Tap the Take Me button on this message, then on this next screen, find the entry for Noise and tap it. From here, toggle the switch to On, then press OK on the pop-up. At this point, your new volume panel is already in place. But if you head back to the Noise app, you can do a little bit more customization and theming. So next, head to the Look and Feel entry, where you can do things like adjust the timeout, change the foreground and background colors, enable a scrubber so that you can adjust the volume without the buttons, or you can set the height of the volume panel. But the coolest option in here is Theme. Use this one to browse through all of the themes that come with Noise. There are plenty of options, so find the one that looks best to you and tap it. And with your theme picked out, head back to Noise's main menu and go to Audio and Media to see additional options. In here, you can specify your default music app if Noise is having trouble detecting when media is being played. You can also set custom actions for long pressing the volume buttons and even enable or disable the volume adjustment sound. From the main menu again, the Labs entry gives you access to even more features. In here you have the ability to enable a Master Volume feature, which will adjust all volume levels at the same time. If you enable this Remote Control feature, Noise will detect when you have an ongoing media notification to allow for improved performance. Then finally, you can add a notification widget that will give you access to your volume levels on any screen. But obviously the main feature here is the new Volume Panel theme, which I must say looks awesome. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.